Wow! Blood pressure is pretty awesome too. Holy mother loving crap! <laughs> I am now on our, well in 12 minutes, it's 4.48 a.m. Uh, as I'm recording this, on our 122 of my post Las Vegas um, fast. I have not eaten since 3 a.m. Uh, 3 p.m. on last Sunday. It's Saturday right now. And uh, I do plan on breaking the fast today, and I have to be smart about it. Um, <laughs> so, uh, but I weighed 225, as the footage showed this morning, which is nuts, which means, because uh, I weighed 239.2 .2 on Monday, which is um, the day after the vacation, I weighed 229 before the vacation so if we just take away that post one we i still i've i lost four pounds in five days after and and mind you i ate and drank las vegas i did get three hundred thousand steps and change i i did so there was some damage control there and now that i think about it because i remember on it was sunday night I went to this karaoke bar they have there called Cat's Meow. Um, I still like to get on the microphone, although I can't. At my age, I can't hit high notes anymore, so I just rap. <laughs> so, but I had four beers, and I had I pre-gamed with bourbon, four beers, and then I went out to eat, and I had uh, a Belvedere martini, two glasses of wine, and then another beer, and then when I went to, I got a shot of vitamin B to keep me awake. But they take your blood pressure, and my blood pressure was way higher than the last time I was there. They're like, what happened? And then I'm like, oh, yeah, I had all that to drink. And I had about four hours of sleep. That might do something to the blood pressure. <laughs> but right now, of course, I'm in crazy levels of ketosis. My GKI is at one, which can, I mean, they say that can actually, if I had cancer, it would be beating cancer up if I had there. So, um that's nuts. And the, the crazy thing is it's I was working. It was very easy. Uh, as long as I'm staying busy, the only thing that makes me feel hungry, it's a hormone called ghrelin. I got plenty in the freezer uh, for my body to feed upon. But um, I am going to break my fast today, and i got to be smart about it. I am going to. So here's the game plan. May take some footage of it. Probably going to start with a bulletproof tea, not coffee, tea. And then I'm going to have some bone broth and some eggs and butter. Not all at the same time. I want to ease my digestive system. We're waking that bad boy back up. So, um, but wow, I think because, again, I'm going to Vegas. I'm going to Prescott next week, but uh, I'm, my, my eating should be really good. And then I'm going to Vegas the week after that. And... Um, I think now, because I have such momentum, I am going to ease up on the drinking, but we're still going to eat like a king, and I just make, I might make every, I, I usually take about five vacations a year, so I am now thinking that after a five-day fast, after each one of the, those vacations, maybe just what the doctor ordered, um, just to, to let you guys know, not only, obviously, did I lose the whatever the heck I had in Vegas, and then four pounds more, uh, which is that 14.2 pounds, I have been feeling euphoric, and my energy is ridiculous. It's like my brain has been awakened and heightened because it's working on those ketones. I don't know. But there are so many pros to this that I believe that any time that I am going to take a vacation, I think I'm mandated now to take a prolonged fast. This has been... The first, this is the first time I've ever done it, and it's been amazing. So, wow. So, 145 days left till Halloween, and I guess we started this bad boy off with a bang. Um, and the other thing I want to get back when I get back from the two weeks of travel is to start getting some meditation going. Um, I keep saying I'm filling my spiritual cup because it just gives you this amazing attitude.